Hello, this morning I decided I would do a very quick sketch of one of the trees outside. As you can probably see by the poor lighting on my video, um, it's a very, very sunny day. And this tree is covered in tree ivy. And so it was quite dark compared to everything around it. And I just thought I'd have a play with these ink tents. I've not used them too much. I have done other videos with them that I'm sure you've seen. But I just wanted to play with them wet in wet. And I've used one brush, quite a wide flat brush. It's about half an inch wide. Um, and I didn't swap my brushes and when you use a big brush to do a full sketch um, you tend not to get bogged down in detail and you make quite a nice loose sketch so just a few simple colours plenty of water um, washing my brush in between so that I didn't get the colours mixed on the palette um, on you know on the actual ink tents blocks themselves so just using it straight from the ink tents blocks um, and you'll see later on in the video, right at the end, I do pick them up and just to put some extra darks in and an extra little bit of definition with the sticks themselves. Um, and I also use a spatula just to bring some lines out and put some light back into the tree itself. But it's not, not a perfect picture, just a little sketch, just a play, um, but it was quite good fun really. So like I say, keep the, keep the colours quite simple. Don't mix too many colours together. It can get a bit muddy. You, you'll see at the top of the picture, um, I got a little bit muddy with the tree. I should have actually started further down the page and given myself more space to work at the top of the painting. But um, it was just a little practice and I rather enjoyed it. So I love the yellow. Um, that's great for getting some light back into your picture. If you feel that, that you've lost some light, that yellow really can brighten things up at the end. Okay, so have a go with what, with whatever's outside your window. Um, like I say, keep one nice big brush, uh, plenty of water and just have a bit of fun. And the great thing about the ink tents is you can build it up and put them on top of each other. Um, so if you want to leave it at any point to dry and then start again, go over some mistakes or whatever, that's fine as well. So have fun with it uh, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. And thanks very much for watching. Bye for now.